So I don't think the monounsaturated fat at all explains why extra virgin olive oil is healthy. If it was what explained what was healthy, you would see the benefit from refined olive oil. You'd see the benefit from canola oil. And canola oil does not have health benefits to it. Um, there's some papers popping up now saying it does, uh, but I don't think you can say, it's not like, it's a chemically extracted oil. Uh, it's, it's monounsaturated fat. Uh, content is high, but it does not have uh, the phenols in it. And extra virgin olive oil clearly, clearly decreases the oxidation of LDL. And that's the important point. You know, how do you keep someone from getting heart disease? I, I think there's a, I have a problem with margarine because of the polyunsaturated fat content. Uh, just as an aside, uh, there is no literature supporting uh, butter being related to any disease. I know, you know, nutrition people don't like it, but it, there's no relationship ever of it causing any heart disease, any sort of issue. So, uh, in dairy fat in general, like full fat milk is fine, cheese is fine, uh, but that's like more of a heart disease literature. But margarine, I think you can make a case, really isn't very good for you, uh, mainly because of the polyunsaturated fat content.